UFC referee Keith Peterson is well known for his commitment to ensuring the safety of fighters in the octagon. During the main card at UFC Charlotte, the result of the bout and damage incurred by the losing fighter is bringing that reputation into question. With impressive precision and timing, Carlos Alberg unleashed a powerful counterpunch that sent Ihor Poshiria crashing to the mat. The New Zealander wasted no time in following up with a flurry of punches and hammer fists, forcing the referee to intervene. Peterson's decision to wait until Black Jack himself stopped throwing punches before stopping the fight is raising some serious questions. Peterson's delay in stopping the fight could have resulted in serious injury to Ihor Poshiria who was unable to defend himself against Alberg's onslaught. Even UFC commentators Daniel Cormier and Dominic Cruz couldn't help but comment on Peterson's actions during the broadcast. While Cormier acknowledged that Alberg had played a role in ending the fight, Cruz couldn't resist taking a swipe at Peterson's nickname of No Nonsense and instead dubbing him All Nonsense Peterson. The UFC Hall of Famer wrote on Twitter, it's not the first time Peterson has come under fire for his refereeing decisions. In fact, the Dominanter and Peterson have a history dating back to UFC 249, where Cruz alleged Peterson stopped his fight early. Keith Peterson's judgment to hold off on stopping the fight between Carlos Alberg and Duelist until Alberg himself stopped landing punches is causing a stir. Critics are suggesting that Peterson's hesitation to intervene sooner could have resulted in severe harm to Poshiria who was helpless against Alberg's barrage of strikes. Fans are expressing their displeasure with Peterson's actions and questioning whether his delay in ending the fight was appropriate. Twitter user at Jim1 remarked, another user at Arthur Orr in 2270 stated, at Fight Night Voice mentioned, 